Hello everyone and welcome back to Stardew Valley. Hope you're all doing well. I'm doing quite well myself. We are back with our mods. They're all installed. As you can see, our husband's room is back to being its neat, kind of orderly stuff with his hash browns in the corner. And he's over here by the uh the cooker. Hello, Alex. Hey honey, I made you a hot breakfast. He made me an omelette. Alex, you're so sweet. Here. If you want to get strong, you have to eat like you mean it. <laughs> Alex, you're so cute. Can we make anything nice? We can make a farmer's lunch. And I want to make some hash browns. And I'm going to give him the hash browns. And we're going to pop in the farmer's lunch into here. So if we come up to our collectibles, our cooking, we're already getting a little bit more of kind of stuff that we can cook. Um, I do want to make a omelette because we have made that. So it's egg and milk. So I will have to do that eventually. But let's come down. And here we go! Our farm is looking very, very pretty. Our broom mod is back. Our witch's hut is back. We're back to being mystical and magical and everything is right in the world. Okay, let's pop in you into here. I keep putting in like... I guess it's okay. I... Hold on a minute. Can I... Can these go in here? They can't. They can only go into there to make coffee. Okay. That's fine. Let's come over here. Let's just grab some, maybe some bok choy. There we go. We can make some pickled bok choy. We can pop in the cranberry jelly into there. We can grab onto our broom. And come all the way down into here. Where our eggplants are actually growing. Thank you very, 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 very much. And we actually have some yams too. All right. I will have to go to Pierre's and get some more stuff to like just grow in here because I do want to have like an extra <gasps> and our little <laughs> our little lamb parrots are back which is amazing. Let me just grab all these grapes. We can give some to Vincent maybe. I know he really really likes them so let's go ahead and let's water everything. Water all of those twice. Oh, yeah. oh. Like, after playing in my world without mods, it's just, it's nice to be back to the magical world with mods. Like, I'm not even lying about how that could that... Do we have to water all of these? Like, I'm pretty sure I, for, I keep forgetting to water all of these crops here. And that's probably why none of them are growing into, like, a, a big thing. Like a giant pumpkin. Because that is uh, my goal of the season, to get them into a giant pumpkin. Thank you very, very much. Let's come down, get some water in here. Thank you. Let's come down. Hello, my lovely little parrots. I love the fact that they have just, just that single blue parrot. There we go. And I do want to make like a duck, um, what was the word? A duck, uh, just a duck pen. I think that would be super, super cute. <gasps> oh wait, is our barn upgraded? Does that mean that we can go get a pig? Oh, and look at that! We have 38,000! So we might as well just go ahead and buy the vault! Which probably means that we should be able to go to Calico Desert tomorrow. If I'm not mistaken, that should be the case. So let's come out, let's grab onto this. Thank you very, very much! Uh, drop that up there, we go! Hello, my little cows. Hello. I know you're just three months old. Yes, you are. You're super, super cute. Let me go ahead and grab out this milk pail. Um, I do want... To... Oh, I can't even drop any. Can I just drop them those into there first? Come out with this. Milk you. You got a star quality one. Mm, silver quality. Okay, we got a normal star quality, which I'm not going to say is too bad. I wish I could keep it though. I want to pop in you guys and I'm going to keep you and you. There we go. So let's come back out. And we'll come back up to our chest. Because our chest is what we have full of items for the Grange display um, here. So we have a... I'm just going to put the cherry... No, that's not what I wanted. Okay. Um, there we go, I guess. Okay. And then I want to put the cranberries up too. The grapes we can put one up of, and we can put the eggplants. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So that's nine items. Um, nine items, give or take. You know what? It's good enough. So let's just come inside. 
come up into our fridge. Hello, Alex. And I need to pop up the mayonnaise. Put that there. I need to pop up some cheese. Some coffee beans, probably. Some milk. And then I'm going to pop up some eggplants. No, I want to pop in the five normal eggplants. And then I do want to pop in a yam or two. So if I take out maybe the cave carrot and pop up these three yams. What can I make now? Ooh! I can make par parsnip soup and glazed yams. Let's do that. And we, can make, we can't make anything else. But that's two more little recipes that we've managed to make. Which is perfect. Even better than I, than I thought. Okay, let's grab hold of our broom, head over to Pierre's, sell some stuff. Oh, and look at that. We're going to get some uh, iridium quality berries just for, uh, just for you know, being like a, a iridium quality uh, searcher and forager. We don't want to eat the cheese. That's not what we want to do. I, do I have room for the hazelnut? I do. Soon, bus. Soon. Don't worry. Don't worry, your little your little hat. We, we will find uh, a way to ride you eventually. And by eventually, I mean literally in about a few minutes, we're going like, to complete it. So I'm so excited! We're getting so far ahead of ourselves lately. Okay, so let's come over. Just check the... Uh, it's Jody's birthday. So I will go down and see if I can find her. She does like some mayonnaise. So I think that would be kind of nice just to give her that kind of a little bit of a... Hey, Penny! Um, so she should be maybe up here. Oh, that was super, super close. Um, Sam, Jody, there you go. Uh, Jody, I'm gonna give you a cheese. Ah, birthday gift, that's very kind of you. I love it, no problem. And I'm gonna give your husband one too, because he seems to like cheeses. You guys both seem to eat very, very healthy, fresh goods. So I think that's a kind of a perfect little match for you guys. Now, I am gonna come up to Pierre's, sell all my stuff, head into the community center, Get the vault package, and then I want to run straight up to Penny, or not Penny, to Robin, and see if she will, you know, buy some stuff for me. So let's uh, do that. Perfecto. And then I want to... No. Mm. I want amaranth seeds, maybe six. No, I want eight. And then artichoke seeds, I want eight as well. Um, bok choy, do we have bok choy? I have corn, pumpkin. Okay, come down. And then I want to buy some more wheat, flour, rice, oil, vinegar. And then I want to buy the deluxe speed grow. I want to buy 16. There we go. And the wallpaper is not too shabby. Okay. Right, so we can come up to Robin now. No, 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 we need to go to the community center now. And then we need to go to Robin. Oh, and the only mod that I couldn't find, by the way, guys, it's so sad. It was George's retexture mod. I found one that kind of seems similar, but it's, it's, it wasn't the George that we know, so I didn't download it. And I'm kind of sad that he went back to being like, you know, kind of the way he was, you know. Okay, let's come over. Because he was kind of dirty and grimy, and I, I didn't really like that. Hello, my little Junibo friend. We're going to purchase. We just purchased it, and we got the bus repair. And we got a crystallarium, which means, guys, that we can actually, for the first time in Stardew Valley playthrough that we have, we can actually replicate diamonds with this crystallarium, which is perfect. There we go. Pew, 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 pew. Hello, my little Juniper friends. When we're done here, we'll return to the other world. <gasps> Look at that! It's so pretty! They did up the desk and everything. Oh, he's so happy. So literally all we need now is the truffles, the fodder bundle, and the enchanters bundle, and then we'll have completed the community center, and we'll be able to somehow f try and get those little uh, Junimos uh, back. Oh, and I also downloaded a retexture for Linus, because remember I was saying that we should like retexture Linus? Well, I did manage to find one, but it's not... You guys are gonna be a little bit shook when you see him. Uh, it's like a young Linus mod. Can I just come over here, please? you. Uh, come up there. Gonna grab those. Come over. 
There we go. Come up, come up, come up, come up, come up. I don't know if he's going to be inside or not, but it's a young Linus model anyway. And he just looks a lot younger. The house is still the same. I wonder if he's inside. Nope, he's not inside, but the cottage does look a little bit prettier. Okay, we, let's come over here. Come down to our... Oh, and I also made him ginger. Yeah, I want I wanted a bit of diversity. So let's uh, come here. So I want to construct farm buildings. So another coop for the ducks, just for the ducks, would be 4,000 gold, 300 wood, 100 stone. So I'm going to do that. I'm going to go straight ahead and do it because uh, it's obviously something I really can do. So it's a 300 wood and 100 stone, which isn't that hard when you think about it. Let's come over here and get you guys. I wish you could make blackberry like jam. As I'm saying it, I know you can, but like, I wish you could like cook it and make it because that would be kind of cute. Let's just come down. Thank you very, very much. Do, 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 do. And Saku is back to being a little tricky puppy. Yes, he is. Okay, so we need to come over, not over here. We need to come over to this one. And we need to pop down 300 pieces of wood. I, I, where is my wood? Oh, there we go. So 300 pieces, please. Maybe it would be better if I did that and just do that. Do, 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 do. 300 pieces and then I need a lot of stone. Wait. I think I need like 100 pieces of stone. There we go. Okay, and now I need just a place to put it. So I'm thinking the chick, the sorry, the ducks can go like down here. So let me just really quickly clean this area up. Um, there we go. Perfecto. And let's head up to Robin's and we can actually make like a little duck uh, coop, which I think would be super, super cute because um, we'll have like a separate area and then we can buy more chickens. And what we'll do is we'll literally just sell, we'll buy chickens to sell them. And if, they, it, like, if they're not blue chickens, we'll just sell them on because I want all kind of blue vitey chickens. And then I, I, I kind of like want one red parrot, but I mean, they're not like... It's not a requirement, you know, I, it, it'd just be nice to have a little bit of diversity in it. Okay, hello Robin, we're gonna construct a, I wanna shop first, see if you have any, you do have more houseplants, so you know me so well. So let's get this houseplant too. We've got a patchwork rug, which is actually quite cute. So I think what I'll do is, I'll construct a farm building, construct that coop. Let's bring it down here. Uh, yeah, let's pop it, pop it there. Perfecto. And the ducks can go in there. Okay. Now I need to come in here, buy this patchwork patchwork rug. Okay, there we go. And I think Marnie's is going to be closed. So what I might do is I might just come in. There we go. Come in this way. Pop into here. Take this car to the quarry. Have just a little bit of a gander. Don't see anything extra. That's okay. Don't need that clay. Let's head to the bus stop. Come down here. There we go. There we go. There we, there we, there we go. Come in here. We can pop down the crystallarium. I kind of want to put the crystallarium, like, close to the house. So maybe pop it up, like... I kind of want the crystallarium to be, like... Like here-ish. So that we can always pop in a diamond. There we go. That's going to make that there. Okay. So then we need a steel hoe. And we're going to get the deluxe speed grow. And then we're going to do that there. There we go. And then we're going to pop up the seeds, the artichoke seeds, I kind of want at the bottom down here. And then the amaranth seeds I want up here. And then I guess we can pop inside. Pop down some more house plants. So this house plant can go over here. And this small little house plant <laughs> can go... I kind of... Oh, that would be cute if you could put it up there. Um, I'm going to pop it down here, maybe. And then I want the patchwork rug to go up here as well. Can you put it under something? 
Okay, you can put it in the room. <gasps> That's cute. I like that there. Okay. Then let's come up here. Let's pop up all these into here. And the blackberries. And let's just pop in all of the coffee beans as well. Pop up the rice and the rice flour. We need to pop up. Oh, we need to pop those up there. So let me take out the... Maybe the iridium quality mushrooms. And we can pop those up there. Then maybe I'll take out the holly. And we can pop up those there. And what else can we make now? We can make hash browns, glazed yams. We can make a piece of bread, which is nice. Uh, we can make stuffing, which is nice. And then we can make plum pudding. Uh, so we're kind of getting a, a, a good few a good few resources here. So what was that? It was plum pudding, stuffing. And wasn't there something else? No, there wasn't. Okay. Okay, Alex seems to be admiring uh, my new decorating skills. Let's come up here, pop you guys in here, pop sell those. Okay. Then we need to water you guys. Perfect. It's 6 p.m. Okay. Uh, let's come in here. Let's water everything here. Oh, that's kind of cool the way you can do that there. The way you can like fill up all three of them. Hello, little slime. Don't worry. It's okay. We should probably make like a little chest or something for all of our slime <gasps> blueberry harvest look at that guys so we're just kind of raking in the money at the moment so it, like as i said like once we start like planting with the greenhouse we're gonna get like so much money we're gonna get a lot more than we normally do which i am all here for like like i am down for this kind of uh return from our investments because we we did spend a lot of money like trying to get all of this kind of stuff and then um you know we didn't have money for so long and now we're just gonna rake in the money every single time so now I just need to water all of these ones there we go I need to water you guys water all of you guys and I need to water this one here and our tree is growing I can't believe the tree is growing in the greenhouse uh, let's pop in a blueberry into there just so it's kind of working away we should probably come up here water all these fairy flowers because I am so sick of these fairy flowers not being grown. Like, I'm, I'm really sick of it right now. Because as far as I know, they don't take this long to grow. Uh, come on. Come on. How long do fairy flowers take to grow? I think it was like eight days or something like that. And I did buy them, like, at the start. But I keep forgetting to water them, which is the problem. But uh, I just wish it was easier. Okay. So now I'm not too sure. Should I go to the mines or not? Because they should be at level 102 is the mushroom level. So we could go for like a quick little mushroom diving tour. I think that'd be kind of cute. So let's come up here. Let's sell the blueberries. And then we go come up here. Let's pop up the slime. Because we almost have 99 slime, which we can compress into a, a slime egg once we have a once we have the slime egg ink the presser, I think it is. Okay, let's come up here. Go to the mines, pop into here. Uh, I think it's 100, and then we go down. There we go. See, it's literally so easy, just like that. Once we know what the what the mine level is. Hello. And look at that. We got an emerald for our little journey too. And I just realized that I never checked our luck or the TV, and uh, that's probably gonna bother me. But we don't have to really worry about that because we just need to leave the mine, come back over here. Come into level 100, come down, and we have the mushroom level again. So isn't that such a neat little, like, trick? It's kind of like, not a hack, but just like a little tip that the levels regrow. And they have to regrow in terms of, like, monsters and stuff like that. So you can just keep farming mushrooms and mushrooms and mushrooms and eventually get, like, a lot of money from it without wasting any of the bombs if your level is close like this. Because if we go level 100, immediately once we go down here, we're already on the mushroom level. Which means as long as we have, like, um our weapons and stuff and we don't take enough like a lot of damage there we go let's grab you and let's grab you we should never uh need to like find the find the ladder down so we can just go back up and up and up okay let's come back over here sorry my friend let's come over here level 100 down again ah there we go Oh, there was only one mushroom this level. Maybe they're getting like too tired to get regrown. Nope, didn't mean to do that. Didn't mean to do that. Didn't mean to go down this one. Level 100. Down again. 
and we'll just soak up all of these. Oh, another emerald. Sweet. Don't know why um, we're getting so lucky with the emeralds, but... I'm not going to complain. Thank you. Let's grab this chest. Oh, and I'm glad I did because then I can see this purple mushroom. And the purple mushroom I actually did... Um, does give us a lot more money than the red mushrooms in terms of like we need less purple mushrooms to give us the same amount of money that we do red mushrooms and i do actually like coming up here to kill these guys just because i, I want them to drop like a slime egg and is there like a way that we can um there we go let's grab you is there a way we can grab the slime the like, slime eggs quicker? Like, is there any, like, hints or tricks or anything that you have to hit them certain amount of times? Or uh, is there a way to, like, box them in to get, like, is there a higher drop rate is what I'm asking? If there's, like, little, like hints and tips that you can get, like, higher drop rates from? Okay, there's a lot of them this way, so I'm not going to risk it because I don't want to, like, risk my health. It's only 11.30. Let's leave the mine. Come back up. Let's go down to the level 100. Back down again. And then, look at that! Already we have 31 mushrooms, and we literally didn't even have to do anything extra uh, with the mines. Just like, repeat, rinse and repeat, and it's such a perfect little way uh, to earn that little extra money. And, uh, we kind of do need a lot of the extra money. Why? Because we're going to be going to Calico Desert in the next episode! Because we finally got the bus repair, which means that we're probably going to come over to here, buy loads and loads of bombs from the dwarf, and uh, kind of go ahead and get straight onto the Calico Desert kind of scene. Because um, we actually haven't been over there. It's it's an area that you actually need to do the community center the community center for so it can be a little bit difficult to get access to it uh, depending on your luck in the game that's why i think it's money because once you have the money you, you can just go and you can mine iridium over there which is uh what i really want to go over there for because if we get more iridium we can make like iridium sprinklers we can make iridium um oh. there we go we can make iridium sprinklers, we can make the slime egg incubator. We like there's so much we can do with the iridiums. Okay, let's come down one. One more. This will be the last one. And I'm glad it's gonna be the last one because we just got an emerald from it. Thank you. I'm really excited to see how much we made because with the mushrooms and the blueberries and the cranberry harvest, uh, we're gonna be pretty rich. So we managed to do like the we managed to do the bus stop. There we go. We managed to do the coop today. We might even be able to uh, upgrade our house in the winter time, which I think would be like such a cool little thing if we can do that. So let's just come over here. Let's sell the mushrooms. Let's sell. Let's actually just sell everything that we have right now. The hardwood, I, except the slime, because I, I am gonna put the slime up into here. There we go. And uh, let's just come into. Uh, oh, I should probably water. The little things down here. And I should lock up my uh, my animals as well. So let's uh, just do that there. I just realized what time it is. I'm not going to be able to lock down my harvest. And I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to collapse. Yep. <laughs> I collapse. But that's okay. We'll just take a trip to the springs tomorrow. But look at how much money we made, guys. Oh, look at this. There it is. There it is. They're fixing the bus. Oh, it's super, super cute. I cannot wait. So that means Pam is finally employed again. Okay, look at that. We literally got 10,000 from farming. We got like the cranberries, we got the blueberries. Okay, so blueberries do like a lot more than cranberries do, like a lot more. So then we have like the mining, so we got 750 for that. And then we got foraging, we got like 8,000 from the red mushrooms and 5,000 from the purple mushrooms, which is amazing. So mushrooms and blueberries are kind of what we do need to do. So I think I might like get a greenhouse mod, split my greenhouse half and half, half blueberries, a section for the trees, and then a portion for, um, for coffee beans. But that's going to be it today, guys. Bye.